Hey, what's going on? It's Twin Sports, sports. TV. This is our sports meets music. It's our live podcast. The and live know podcast. What's going on. It's going down right here. It this is what we blend it to: sports, music, music. entertainment, whatever, yep, yep. whatever you want to claim it. Yep, yep. That's what whatever you have. Ha- however you want to claim it. <laughs> Twin Sports TV is about to go down. It's yep. sports meets music. Hey, you know we got the hot topic of the day. We do benefits of youth sports. That's what it is. So make sure y'all stay tuned. Get your game, game up. up. Woo! <laughs> Our sports meets music, our live podcast. Y'all know what no. time it is. Y'all know how we do it. We about to get busy in here. Yeah. Get your game up, baby. Make sure you go pop that. Let's go, let's go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's our theme song. We rock it every time. Oh, yeah. We're good if we're on your side. Show us our 795. Channel 24, we tell us five. We do this here for the youth. We do. We want to help you in school. Yup, yup. We want to give you that proof. That proof. So that you can really make it too. All you got to do is study. Make it cool of all, all your buddies. buddies. All you got to do is stay focused. Stay focused. That's how you get to this money. Money. Graduate and go to college. Yep, yep. That's how you get to the dollars. Dollars. That's how you get all that knowledge. Dollars. Twins for the film. Atlanta. Get your game up. Charlotte. Get your game up. TV. Get your game up. Memphis. Get your game up. New Orleans. Get your game up. Miami. Get your game up. Throwing them towels just right in the air. Twins boys, get your game up. Twins boys, get your game up. Y'all know how we do it. This our get your game up. This our theme song. We're going in. This our sports meets music. It's our live podcast. Y'all know what time it is. Y'all know how we do it. We getting it in. Yup, yup. Make sure y'all tune in with us every week. We down. We We here. We lit. It's going down. Let's go. Let's go. Who's checking in with us? Check in. Let us know what city and state you represent. Let's go, let's go. Get your game up. Get your game up. Tell about you running free. Oh, yeah. Put the whole quarter on the field. On the field. Gotta get your game up. Get them up. Gotta work on them skills. Keep pushing. Go hard. Even if it ain't how you feel. That's how you get recognized. Oh, That's yeah. That's how you be a big deal. With twin sports, blue cameras out. That means you a big deal. We pull up and you hit the court. Then throw you on a big grill. So turn it up, turn it up, turn it up. Oh, yeah. Stay in school till you can't learn it up. Yeah, you can run it up. If you drop it out, you ain't learning nothing. New York, get your game up. Chicago, get your game up. Cleveland, get your game up. Detroit, get your game up. Big Ham, get your game up. St. Louis, get your game up. Throwing them towels just right in the air. Twins boys, get your game up. Twins boys, get your game up. Y'all know how we do it. This is our theme song. Twins boys, get your game up. 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 Get your this how we do it. We can't get in, baby. Let's go, let's go. 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 Get your game up. In Dallas. Get your game up. Throwing them towels just right in the air. Twins, boy, get your game up. Woo! Yeah, yeah. Y'all know what time it is. This is our sports meets music. It's our live podcast. Oh, yeah. We get up in here. We are. We're going down. Y'all know what's up. Twins, sports TV. Yeah. We in the building. We in the building. We are. It's about Woo! to get turned. I got to give yeah, you something to drink. We're going to red pill everybody today. Y'all know what time it is. We getting it in. We got the red pill on deck. Who want to get red pill? Right. Hey, we ready. We ready. We ready. Y'all know what's up. We hype. This is our Sports Meets Music. It's our live podcast. Yep, yep. It's going down. It is. We appreciate y'all tuning in and turning up with us. Check in with us. Let us know what city and state you representing. Where you at? Hey, where you at? Hey, you play for a team? Hit us up. Let us know. Yeah. Let us know what team, what position you yep, play. Yep. What age group? We here. We turn. It's about to go down. 
It is. We got the twin talk coming up. We do. Good habits formed at youth make all the difference. Yes, it does. It Ooh, does. Had to get this juice in. Had to get the juice in. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> ah, ah, ah. So you should identify one or two habits for your yes. young ones, boys or girls, whoever's in playing sports. Right. That's critical for their success in right. sports. They need to start that early. Early. Really right. young. So right. they can get a habit. Form a habit of it. Right. To be successful. And I just want to tell you. A good example of that is like when my son was really young, like in Pee Wee Rec Ball, probably around seven or eight, and he started football. Well, he started really young. He was five. But when he turned about seven or eight and he became the quarterback of the team, the leader of the team, and, you know, he wasn't on one of those powerhouse, those dominant teams or whatever. So I had to train him early as a quarterback. No matter what happens – you live in the moment on every play. Exactly. So if you get sacked or in a September or anything yeah. happens, you got to be willing to pick yourself up, pick right. the team up, and get back in there and act like it's it, it's the first down. Like whatever right. bad happened, never happened. Exactly. And I started that habit with him very early, probably around six, or, um, six seven, or eight years old, mm-hmm. and it has stayed with him to this day. And it's amazing how coaches can watch him in the pocket as a quarterback in high school now, and they say he's so... Shout out to Duluth High School. Right, those hey. Wildcats. We love those Wildcats. And he stays in the pocket. He's so poised in the pocket. That's right. like the, the word all the coaches say. He's just so poised. He's just so calm. That's because right. he lives in that moment. You exactly. know, he doesn't let things bother him easily. He, he knows that he has a job to do. He gets out there and he get it done. Vigo Breezy. We about to drop her song. Shout out to VA, baby. Dollar Sign Twist Force TV if you want to cash app us. But this is the name of the song. So make sure you go cop that. Here we go. Here we go. Let's go cash app. Vigo Breezy. Let's go. Let's go. Y'all know what time it is. We're going to get it in. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Somebody in the chat. Hey, ladies. Hey. That's what they said to us. We right. Said, hey. Joe Arnold, what's going on? No, what's, what's up? up? What's up? 
What's the deal? We appreciate y'all tuning in and turning up with us. Right. Checking in. It's our sports music. It's our live podcast, man. It's about to it go is. down. Well, it is going down. It is. We're getting it in. We got what? The game teaser coming up? Let's go. We the got player a spotlight. Great artist. Ooh. Not a great artist. Great athlete. Right. King Madden, number 26, yeah. running back. He's a linebacker. Tucker so Lions, Tucker Lions nine, 9 you. New, we baby. love those Tucker Lions. Exactly. Rocking that green. There you go. Oh, Georgia yeah. in the building. We got some athletes in Georgia. Y'all make sure y'all send us the highlights if you're in another city or state. Right. And y'all think y'all can mess with Georgia. Let's go. Let's go. Let's drop it. Let's drop it. Topic coming up. Uh, benefits of you sports. Oh, yeah. We got somebody checking in online for us. Let's yeah, see. Let's, let's see, see what's who, going on. Who we got? We got all the platforms going. Make oh, sure yeah. you hit that smash, smash that like button for us. We love seeing y'all at the games. Hey, hey we thank love you. being at the games. We love y'all at the we games. We appreciate that. Y'all and we love when all the kiddos hands. come up to us and just want hugs and show us some love. Yeah. We do. They go get your game up. We go, woo! <laughs> Y'all yeah. love us at the game, but we love y'all more. We do. Exactly. We love watching these kids. All kind of kids from all over. All, over. all different age groups. We love All it. the sports. We do. A lot of people say we think we just do football and basketball. Right. We do We do cover a lot of We do cover football. a lot. But all sports yeah, we love. Yeah, track. So make sure y'all Cheerleader competitions. Let us know. get into know. that volleyball or that lacrosse. Right. Mm. Right. We- Soccer. We, we, we love it all. We it's do. Just sports. Those tennis players, you know, they need their highlights too. Exactly. They so want to get seen. Hit us up. Hey, hey, hey. hey. We the new faces of sports media. This we is where it's are. at. Let's go. Hey. Okay. We, all we got. We see y'all. Hit us up. Hit us up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Physically fit is one of them. Exactly. What are we talking about? What's that benefit? The hot topic. Benefits of youth sports. sports. There's yeah. some key benefits of youth sports. Right. That's why we love it. Right, it's here's, kids here's 12 of them. There's, there's probably a lot of them out there, right. but these is 12 of them. It's yeah. got a nice little graphic for people to see so they can relate to it. So, number one, physically fit. Number Make two, sure you're working out. You right. got to be strong. Keep um, it, keep the weight under control. That's good because obesity good. is really rampant um, in the country. So, we, we need to stay physically fit, especially, especially in our the youth. Kids. Right, right. So, Start them early. Talking about those good habits. Getting outside. That's one of them. Sports yep. is a key to that. Yep. Improve cardiovascular endurance. Mm-hmm. Definitely need that. We don't need no mishaps. We need everybody physically fit. So definitely that's a good one. So that's one of the benefits of youth sports. Improves academic results. Yes, that is it does. true. And we, we witness to that. We are because yeah. we're not only out there on the fields at the kids' games. We go into the, the schools. schools. We're in their classrooms. Mm-hmm. We like to pop in to see what they're doing because we have a bunch of school programs 
that we have with the youth. So that's definitely important and it definitely improves their academic results. And one thing too, and that's why a lot of people work out early in the morning mm -hmm. because it gets their day going. And gets it the blood pumping, stimulates, stimulates your the brain. brain. Yes, so that's, yes. that's good. So when your coach asks you to work out before the game, don't get mad. Don't complain. Right. Just do it because it's going to help you right. throughout the day. Mentally and physically. And also the benefits of youth sports, it increases self-esteem mm -hmm. and self-confidence. Yep. It does. You know? Because you might be a shy, a shy kid. Yep. And then you get around other kids that are a little more outgoing than you. You can kind of pick up on those things. It right. can kind of help you. I kind of balance it out. Coaches can pull it out of right, you. Too. Right, right. Yeah. What about improves concentration? Definitely. Definitely that. Yep, yep. Because you have to concentrate when you're doing sports. Right. You have to be thinking about you what you got to do next, what happened, what, how do you need to improve, and all those things. What about number seven, keeps them out of drugs? Oh, yeah. that's such a plus. Keep With all the, the distractions street. and temptations these kids got, mm -hmm. they need sports to, exactly. to help them out, to distract them away from those negative things in life. Mm -hmm. Decrease dropout rate. Definitely, Definitely in school because if you got to be there to play um, sports, sports, you got to have those grades up to play. And the attendance and has got to be, be there. Right, So exactly. that's so important. And they've done plenty of studies on that. That, that is true. That is mm -hmm. so true. Okay, what about life skills? Number nine, youth sports, it does. It teaches yeah. them discipline, discipline respect, respect self-respect, exactly. and self-discipline as well. Exactly. Uh, teamwork. Exactly. How to play, um, if you're an individual sport, how to do things, motivate yourself. Yeah. And if you're in a team sport, how to play multi with others. Yes. Multitask. How to do more than one important. thing. Yeah. Because they have did a study where they say a lot of athletes after college, they don't go into the pros. But a lot of athletes who um, do sports in college right. get good jobs because a lot of people like to hire them because they know they can do a lot of things right. at one time. Right. They and they're very disciplined. They're very disciplined. They're Respectful focused. Respectful. And, they're and that's through all the training of being an athlete through right. over the years. Forming good habits when they're young. Yep. 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 Pay attention. It's some good stuff, y'all. Yeah. Pay attention. We're red pill in the day. We, we are. The benefits of youth sports reduce stress and depression. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Especially now with these days, the, the, what's going on. A lot of kids are struggling to either try to comprehend and figure out what's going on. And sports is an escape for them. Exactly. It's a way that they can express themselves and they can just release, let go. And guess what? Be kids. Mm -hmm. Right. That's what we love. We just want them to be, be kids. kids. Be happy. Yeah, yeah. we twins. With we that are. We yeah. are twins, right? See, y'all seen it first live. Right. Be happy. Uh, number 11, leadership, leadership skills. skills. We love this one. It is. Because some kids who might not think they're leaders can yeah. play sports and they can pull it out of them. Yeah, exactly. Yep, yep. And if you're a quarterback, you got to be the leader of the team. Right. If, you if you're a captain, captain or, or basketball yep. or softball, baseball, whatever, right. you got to be the leader. Yeah. And it gets you to communicate with others. It exactly. pulls you out of your shell, out of your comfort zone. Number 12, uh, the benefits of youth sports improve mental and moral qualities. Ooh, I yes, like indeed. that one. We need a lot more of that moral qualities because I exactly. think that's... And, and a lot of that, um, kids can get that. They have a good coach. Yes. So shout out to those good, good coaches. coaches. We love we those love good those. coaches. Especially the ones that ain't got to cuss at the kids. Right. You know, you, you can, can get them do to it. do what they need to do without With some good degrading words. them. Good words. Right. Love. We love those kids. We don't like those ugly words that exactly. they use. Exactly. Because, you know, when my son was, was five years old, there was one coach on the whole mm -hmm. football team, he was able to manage this team and take them all the way to the championship and win without even cussing at them. And they were young. They were young. Five. Five, five and six. Playing in the grass and not focused. He was able to get those kids focused to go all the way. And we're, not, and we're not talking about no soft team either. Right. These were some balling kids. Right. Right. <laughs> he didn't have to cuss. He was able to get them under control with using... At a young pop. age. Right. Not, you know, you, you, you can be firm, exactly. but you don't have to be ugly. Nasty. Yeah. No, no. No. We love those kids. We do. And, you know, those, it, it, improve, it improves their mental state and moral qualities. Because those qualities, you'd be surprised you pass them on to these guys. Right. They so look if up the coach is always cussing at the kids, they're probably going to go to school and try to coach, cuss out the, the teacher or, right. not the or their peers. classmates. Right. So, so you they know. don't need anything. And if a coach is respectful, then most likely they'll pick up those good habits and be respectful to others. And a lot of, I think a lot of coaches don't even understand that as well. Right. Because we've had an incident 
where a parent, we was just out in the, um, at a practice with one of the teens and a parent was telling us that their kid was misbehaving in school and mm-hmm. he was using a lot of bad words in school and was getting in trouble. Mm-hmm. And the parent was coming up to us talking about, you know, how they can fix this. And they was thinking about going to the coach to see if the coach could help them. But you know what? It was the coach that was influencing them. Right. So I don't know if that was a good thing. <laughs> mm-hmm. If you some coaches you just can't go to. Right. But see the importance of having a good coach because you just never know. And right. some parents don't know because they just drop their kids off at mm-hmm. practice and they don't know what these coaches are doing with right. the kids. Right. So shout out to the coaches that's really putting it down. Right. And really stepping up being role models for these right. young athletes. Because right. And a lot of times the coaches won't have to complain about the parents if, you know, they felt secure that the coaches were really being positive and encouraging to the kids. Exactly. You can be firm now. Yeah, you can get in that. that tail. We with that. We with that. But you ain't got to be degrading, yeah, nasty, ugly. and ugly. Especially them babies. Man, right. we love those babies. babies. So little and cute. And these coaches don't understand. When we go see them in, in the school, school system, see, they see them with them helmets on. And boy, they could be treacherous on that field with they them helmets. Can be. But when you take them little helmets off, they just as cute them as they can five-year-olds be. and six-year-olds. Right. We be look we look at them in the schools and we just like y'all so little and they so cute. But they be balling on the field. They do. We, we don't know how they it. do it. Right. You but can be firm, it. but not nasty. That's right. Yeah, we love it. <laughs> we love yeah. our coaches. Look, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to, to our good coaches. <laughs> we love it. What we got up next, girl? What we got up next? I don't know. We dirty. We got a game coming up. Let's go. We Let's got go. a Good game coming up. Creeping. I know, Let's right? Go. We got the Brookwood uh, yeah, Broncos going against the Lawrenceville Black Knights. Now you. Let's get go. it. Woo! We are live in Lawrenceville, Georgia, and you're watching Twin Sports TV. And this is our Get Your Game Up highlight segment where the camera's rolling. Anything goes. We're here for the big game of the week, and oh, we're yeah. getting it in with, with a whole lot of football. football. Who we got on the field? Hey, we got the Brookwood Broncos yeah. going against the Lawrenceville Black Knights. It's the nine and under. They're about to hit the field. They're about to get it in. You're watching Twin Sports TV. Get your game up. Woo! Get them up, baby. Yeah. Hey.
we're live on the field and you're watching Twin Sports TV. And it's halftime and we're down at the game with the Brookwood Broncos versus the Lawrenceville Black Knights. And the score is... Hey, the score is 26 to 0. Those Broncos are on top. But we'll see what happens after the half. You're, you're watching, watching Twin Sports TV. Get your game up. Woo! <laughs> live on the field and you're watching Twin Sports TV. The game just ended. It was a great ball game, but win or lose, you're, you're watching Twin Sports TV. Get your game up. Woo! Get them up, baby! Yeah. Hey! <laughs> I love it. Let's go! We appreciate y'all yep. tuning in and turning up with us. Yep. Hey, if you want those game teasers, definitely hit us up. Yep, go to yep. Amazon, get our book. We just got our new book in. So yep, make yep. sure you go there. Hit that, hit that. We appreciate it. We love y'all. Peace. Get your game up. Woo!